Hey, what's up, YouTube? Today I will be showing you how to update your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad uh, onto version 5.0. So first of all, you need to know if your device is eligible for the download for the update. Go on Apple.com, and you'll see if it's uh, eligible. Second, you have to uh, check for updates on iTunes. You click on check for updates. It'll say blah blah blah. Your iTunes is correct, or it'll show you to how to update. And then it'll say a new iPhone software blah 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 5.0. So you can click download and update, or download only. But I suggest to press on download and update. Then once this is done, make sure it's connected, and then your iPhone should be um, restoring. Once you've clicked to update, everything is uh, automated. So it'll take a while, but uh, be patient. Your uh, iPhone or iDevice will update right away. Then you will see this little thing, your iPhone has been restored, factory settings, blah blah blah, so it is restarting and it should appear in iTunes in a couple minutes. So it should appear here and as you can see there is nothing going on, it should restart in a couple seconds. So as you can see here, you can set your iPhone as a new iPhone or set it as your old iPhone. So if it's your, it's your first iPhone, set it as a new iPhone or if you had your old backup, uh, backup it from your old backup. <laughs> so I'm going to choose to back it up from my old uh, iPhone. So congratulations, you've just uh, upgraded your iPhone to uh, 5.0. I guess you just have to uh, enter your Apple ID in order to activate and uh, also to set up your uh, cloud account. If you don't know what your Apple ID is, it is the account to use when you download some music and download some application. So this is iCloud and uh, this is where you will be able to sync all your applications, your song or whatever document you want. Uh, onto the internet and when you will let's say you lose your your iPhone or you, you lose some pictures or you want to share some pictures from your iPhone onto your Mac on or onto your iPad this is where it'll be it'll be on the internet so I want to use iCloud definitely and I um, strongly suggest to use it so I click next Merge with iCloud, your contacts, bookmarks on this phone will be uploaded and merged uh, with iCloud. Yeah, merge. Use iCloud to back up your iPhone daily over Wi-Fi. Back it, back up to iCloud, yes. So, um, this is Find My iPhone. So, this is a very useful uh, application that I made a video of and it'll actually find your iPhone if you lost it. If you have your uh, SIM card in it and you have internet connection it'll find your iPhone uh, in the world wherever it is. So I definitely definitely want to use uh, find my iPhone. So I click next Diagnostic and usage. Um, pff, no, I don't want to send any information to uh, Apple, but it's your choice. 
So all right, it's uh, your iPhone is all set up. So start using iPhone. So that's it. You are now on uh, iOS 5.0, and uh, that's it. Congratulations. Enjoy your new device.